Good morning. God bless. Praise the Lord Jesus. Uh, <laughs> I hope everybody has a blessed and wonderful day today. God bless you. Um, if you don't know Jesus, get to know him. I, I just encourage it. You know, I get excited about so much. Um, and I just, I want to read a little a verse for us today. It's going to be in chapter five. Um, therefore, since, and, and it's going to be chapter five, Romans chapter five, and it's going to be verse one and two. There, dear Lord, we just ask that you give us understanding and some kind of joy or revelation in your message today. Thank you, Lord. And, and thank you for all you do in Jesus name. Um, Therefore, since we have been made right in God's sight by faith, we have peace with God because of what Jesus Christ, our Lord, has done for us. Because of what Jesus has done for us. Ooh, he's faithful, boy. Praise the Lord. Because of our faith, Christ has brought us into this place of undeserved privilege where we now stand in grace. <laughs> His grace. We confidently and joyfully look forward to sharing God's glory. You know, Man, we have an imperishable inheritance. It talks about that in Peter, you know, in heaven, you know, and and then and, and then we 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 just a lot of people, you know, I don't I don't know about y'all, but like you know, I'm I'm glad the Lord has me doing the things He has me do, and I enjoy them, and um, I go through frustration sometimes, but that's 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 pretty natural of me, you know, <laughs> and I I'm just thankful for the frustrations I go through because it helps me learn from them, you know, being thankful for them and. Because I know God's developing character and, and, and that humility that comes along with it, you know, would 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 just a lot of things that you go through. I don't you know, you go to different different levels, different devils, you know, that's what they say, but uh, I don't want to confuse nobody with that. But he sends you from glory to glory, you know, and and each glory has different levels of trials and different different levels, you know, and I just I just encourage people today to understand that 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 you know, what I get from this right here is one day we're going to be home with the Lord, first and foremost. Thank you, Jesus. And it's going to be way better than what we're doing here. But, our, you know, our, our main purpose here is to help encourage people to get to know the truth or get to know the Lord or or, or, or however we, we bring service to, to the Lord. And I just, you know, we're all gifted and blessed in so many different ways that, that, that we don't even, this uh, the society will water down the gifts and blessings that you truly have in, that are within you. God gave you a tool to fight the battles that you're going to go through on this world. We're all necessary. And, and, and God loves us all the same. He reigns on the just and the unjust. He love. That's why, you know, Jesus talks about loving your enemies and praying for those who persecute you because that's God. That's what God does. So why, as we develop a character of God, we learn to do the things that God does. Because we're putting on godliness, because we were made in his image, because Jesus died for us to be more like him. And Jesus was the perfect image of that. He died for everyone that was against him and asked for forgiveness on them. You understand? That's God, the character of God. That's the character of love. And uh, there's no other way. And <laughs> praise the Lord Jesus. And I just I just hope everybody has a wonderful and blessed day today. And I can get very deep and I, you know, I, I try not to do that too much, but I just want to encourage people today, man, just stay close to the Lord and trust him. He's got a plan for you. He's got a purpose for you that, 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 you know, nothing can get in the way of if you continue to center, just surrender your life to the Lord and continue to walk in his will. I have to surrender daily. You know, I do. I'm just being honest. It says, put away that old man and put on the new man. You just have to trust him when he says stuff like that, you know, and as you trust him, you know, things work out for your good. You start to read the word, then you start to see the beauty in it. You start to learn and just trust him. And, and, and he develops you into godliness. You love your brothers. You love, you love everybody, you know, and, 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 and you're, you have a godly love and an understanding. And some things are hard. Some situations are hard, but he's going to get you through and, and he will not leave you nor forsake you. And he will not sleep nor slumber. He will deliver you from wicked lies, vanity, self-pride, because pride of life is a lie from the devil. And I'm telling you, that's what made the devil fall from heaven. You understand? He fell down like lightning. Pride will make you fall. You understand with the devil. And, you know, and I just I just encourage you to pray that away from you. The, the, the things of this world, this vanity, these vain philosophies are not true. You got to get in that Bible and get another Lord because everything's break you. Everything continues to snatch you down. But Jesus will get you through. Just trust him and have a sincere heart and continue to read the word. Stay in there. Stay in there. Because he wants to make he wants to show you what he's got for you. He's got things here for you as well as there. He's got things for you to do here. You know, he put on a servant and became a servant. 
That's God's character. He bends his, he inclines to us. David talks about incline to me. He inclines to it. He's ready to answer a prayer for us in his timing. He loves us and, and he knows what's best for us. <laughs> you know, and Jesus knew him so well. He's like, you know, we pray for things we don't even know nothing about. And, and, and he says, our father who art in heaven, you know, you just keep it simple and pray for our father and who art in heaven. That's what Jesus was saying. But, you know, Paul talks about in prayer and supplication about everything, you know, because Man, it's just wonderful to know these things. It says, be careful for nothing but in prayer and supplication for everything. So I just encourage someone to, they, you know, just, just pray about everything as much as you can. In every situation, just ask the Lord, you know, and, and yield into the spirit instead of to the flesh. He will help you. He will guide you. You're covered in the blood. God bless you. Have a blessed and wonderful day. I can keep going on and on about Jesus. I love him, man. And I love the life of the Lord and... <laughs> Just living in him is amazing. So I just encourage people to get to know him. If they don't understand a lot of things I said, I I just hope that and pray that you get to know him. God bless you this morning. Jesus is the way.